Hello and welcome to the 22nd in my series, Proverbially Speaking, Reflections on Verses from the Book of Proverbs. If you enjoy this, please consider hitting the like button at the bottom. And also, if you haven't already, subscribe to the Northfield Church of Christ's YouTube page, and you will be able to be alerted to content like our live Sunday morning streaming of our worship services and our streaming of our Bible studies on Sunday mornings as well as the Sunday evening service performed by our pastor, Mark. So before I begin, let me start as I usually do with a prayer. Our loving and kind Father, I thank you for your patience and for the grace that you bestow upon your children. Bless me now that my thoughts may be pleasing and acceptable to you. It is in your name that I pray. Amen. So today I want to look at a few verses from the first chapter of the book of Proverbs. And they read, A wise man will hear and increase learning, and a man of understanding will attain wise counsel. To understand a proverb and an enigma, the words of the wise and their riddles. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom. And instruction. What do you think of riddles? Are you one to solve them quickly? Are you one who needs the answer immediately and to put it in its place as solved? We think of riddles as games to be solved. How about an enigma? Is an enigma meant to be solved? I like enigmas. I like movies where the ending is unclear, where you are left to your imagination and thinking to understand it. Fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, this says. Does that scare you? Fear has a purpose. It perks up our senses. It tunes us more to listening and to hearing. It stirs up the adrenaline. Open yourself up. We are not as powerful as knowing, as complete in our answers as our Lord. And we need to fear him enough to take in his lessons, to increase our own knowledge. We have to begin small and fearful, not afraid, but fearful, and understand what we don't understand. Some enigmas don't have answers that we can understand. And that is okay, too. We will still increase in understanding. I hope these thoughts made you think a little bit, and I hope you tune in again for my proverbially speaking. Thank you for listening.